Let's go do the taste test here. Turn that down a little bit. Tell you what I did here is I boiled uh, six chicken drumsticks um, from the freezer and boiled that for about 40 minutes in some chicken bouillon cubes, uh, one and a half chicken bouillon cubes and one pork bouillon cube. Put some spice in there, some um, lots of garlic, lots of garlic. And um, then after about 40 minutes, um, after that boiled and sep the, bo the meat separated from the bone, I took the bone off, put, took the bone out. Then I put a, a packet of cream of potato soup mix in there. And it tastes really good. I, sh I cut up all the chicken in small pieces, all those drumsticks. Oh, mmm. Some talk about them. Some talk about. Now, I'm gonna put this in after. But I got some uh, noodles here. So I got some shell noodles. Some rotini noodles. And some wide egg noodles. Which one shall I use? You know exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> Egg noodles. Rotini. And some uh, shells here. I'm not going to put all the shells in there. Need to leave a little bit of room there. I'll turn that on medium there. Um, yeah. I'm gonna need a little bit more water in here. Some hot water in there. Get it up to a boil here. Right there. Then I'll taste test it again here. What I'll do is I'll even put some, uh, some spaghetti noodles in there. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right there, man. Boom. That's good. I got rid of some of those um, half bags there. And then I'll get that up to a boil. And I shall see how much more water I need to put in there. I think I'll need to put some more water in there. But I will taste test this first. Because I just put a bunch of water in there. See, see if I need to put some an another half a bullion cube in there. Probably not. Because I'm going to be putting that chick cream of chicken in there. Oh, wow. Boom! That's what I'm freaking talking about. Yeah. Hmm, I don't know about that stuff. I don't know. Should I use that? I don't know. I don't think so. I don't think I'm gonna use that. It didn't it didn't pop right. It didn't pop right. When I popped it open, it did not pop right. So I'll just throw that one away. There. This one's like way old. I've had that thing for years. So I'll just um, look for another one here. Creamy chicken right here. Creamy chicken right there. This is probably no better, but. <laughs> there we go. This one popped and it it's it's um looks much better. So I'll just dump this whole thing in there. Hopefully it all comes in out, out at once there. Usually these Campbell ones don't come out very clean. I'll have to um, rinse it out with a little bit of water here, get most of it out, and then run some hot water in there. Just get that up to a boil there. Get that up to a boil and simmer it for a few minutes. Get them noodles cooking. We'll just run some hot water in this here right here. 
that much right there. And just right there. Just like that. So we can get all the flavor out of that can there. There we go. Now I'll just stir this up a little bit here. Hopefully break up some of those, um, break up some of that uh, chicken noodle or that um, cream of chicken there. It'll break out up as it starts boiling, as it gets back up to temperature there. I'll turn it up to medium high here, get it up to temperature. But it should thicken up really good here. I might, just might have to put um, a little bit more bullion in there. I might not have to though. It tasted really, really good. It's very, very strong. I did put a lot of bullion in at first, and that um, that potato pack, uh, that potato soup packet, that creamy, creamy potato soup packet, had a lot of salt in it. But it was very flavorful. It tastes just like potatoes and chicken soup. So, so now it's starting to break up here a little bit. That's good. That um, cream of chicken is starting to break up, starting to dissolve here a little bit. I'll take a little, another taste of it in here. Mmm. Yeah, it kind of watered it down a little bit. It has a lot of fat in it from the chicken because the chicken, the chicken drumstick still had the uh, skin on it, but I did remove the skin. Still tastes really good. I might have to put just a little bit more bullion in there. Get this, um, get this up boiling again here. I'll just, I'll just turn it on medium low here. Just watch it for a minute. Should take about three minutes for it to start boiling again. It's already starting to boil right now, so I'll just turn it on medium low. Medium low should be good. Just so those noodles cook. Should take about eight or ten minutes for those noodles to cook. Yeah, the spaghetti noodles will be really soft, but um, it's all good. You know what I'm saying? Well, thanks for watching.